Kansas and Missouri have high maternal mortality rates, especially amongst black women. That's why a KC nonprofit called Uzazi Village focuses its research on improving just that. Ahead of Black Maternal Health Week, KSHB 41's Meg Alyssa Jackson passed the mic to women whose experiences pushed them to help educate others. Ask a black woman about their pregnancy experience. Their answers might follow a trend. My first I ended up getting induced. Um, it turned out to be coded as a voluntary induction, but it was explained to me as a necessary medical induction. And I subsequently had a postpartum hemorrhage and I almost died from it. Another mother, Nadira Muhammad, originally from New Jersey, was living in West Africa when she found out she was pregnant with her third child. Same things we hear here about death and it, but but it's worse. It was worse. It was we heard stories of women going back and forth to hospitals and, and dying on the way and no, no blood because of the, the lack of blood banks. Thorough research from health organizations in the past several years reveal black mothers in Missouri have the highest rates of hypertension and are three times more likely to die within a year of pregnancy compared to white women. I think the gaps are ubiquitous and universal. Our system of health care is not responsive appropriately to black and brown women and often our responses to those women are grounded in racial stereotype. A former labor and delivery nurse herself, Hakima Payne said she saw inequities, so she became one of the founders of Uzazi Village. It's a research-based nonprofit focused on improving black and brown maternal and infant health. So we just want to see a healthier community, and Missouri does a particularly poor job of caring for it's black and brown mothers. There are mothers behind the push to changing the healthcare system. I could see that it's not easy on either end, you know, being a black woman trying to give birth, but then also being on the other end and being black women and trying to help women um, have safe birth. And even if it's not at Uzazi, sometimes you need a village that's been there. I'm just somebody who's from this literal neighborhood. I grew up around this corner. And it's people in here that look like me. In Kansas City, Alyssa Jackson, KSHB 41 News.